Hey folks, welcome back to the channel. I'm here at Orange County, New York. It is Wednesday, uh, 7 o'clock, 7.15 in the morning. We're gonna head over to Braden Air Park in Easton, Pennsylvania. I'm gonna pick up my friend Tom, a uh, veteran, and we're gonna fly down to Atlantic City for the air show. Uh, so they really, it's for the veterans, this air show. So he asked me eight months to go. He's 78, 82 years old. So we're gonna try to put him in the plane and that's what we're gonna to do today for him. Uh, I've been a volunteer for the, with the Phillipsburg Emergency Squad for numbers of decades and decades of, I don't really know exact amount, but probably 40 plus years. So we're gonna do that for him today. So stick around, so we're gonna go from Braden, well, Orange County to Braden, and then we're gonna pick him up, and then Braden to Ocean City, New Jersey, and then get picked up and head over to Atlantic City to watch the air show. So stick around, we'll see you in the cockpit. Good morning, folks. Welcome back. We are at Orange County, New York, not California. And uh, we're gonna head over to Brayden, like I said before. I'm uh, gonna pick up Tom, and we're gonna head over to Atlantic City. Uh, that's the plan for today. Um, and then we'll see where we go from there. So what we're gonna do is get the weather here at Orange County. Let's get the GPS going first here. Did all my updates this morning. Now, there's no weather here. See what we got. I think the weather are calm. Sky condition clear. Temperature one niner Celsius. Dew point one seven Celsius. Altimeter two niner niner five. Remarks. Density altitude niner hundred. Orange County Airport, Montgomery, New York. Automated weather observation one one two eight Zulu. Wind two four zero at zero five. Visibility. One zero. Sky condition clear. Temperature one niner Celsius. Dew point one seven Celsius. Altimeter two niner niner five. All right, we're gonna take two two. We got that two niner niner five in the altimeter. Uh, but two two is right here. We'll take that straight out basically, and we're gonna go to Brayton Air Park. So the uh, the video probably won't be available but uh, this weekend is the air show New York air show here at Orange County so that should be cool yeah finally flying uh, get you guys on video here it's been a while much so much going on then the plane was down a little bit I had a little bit of a, a hangar rash it'll say the least uh, nothing major uh, but I had to get that taken care of Goes to the paint shop hopefully soon. Oh, so never rush when you're putting your plane away, that's for sure. I think I've been flying for 12, 13 ish years and never had an issue. Um, but yeah, don't rush when you're putting your plane away. Other than that, everything seems to be going great. Uh, I flew back, I flew to Oshkosh, as you know, and back. This plane did great there as well. Hopefully, uh, Autopilot at some point. And um, we'll see what happens with the autopilot. A couple things coming out um, for the uh, Moonies. Um, so that'll be awesome to see what goes on there. Um, other than that, first video in a while flying somewhere. I really didn't, I really haven't done anything this year. Um, I really didn't much of anything. Went to Block Island, I think, once. Uh, Oshkosh, of course, but really hasn't. I really haven't flown around. Been busy. Um, fuel prices were really high. Um, to, for me, it's just the uh, principle behind it. It was just so expensive. You go down to Blairstown and back. It used to cost you like forty bucks. Now it's going to cost you like a hundred bucks <laughs> for breakfast. So it's almost like okay, 
let's just uh, drive to the village here in Montgomery and get breakfast and hang out and you know. But uh, but yeah. So uh, hopefully uh, um, prices come down. And it's, uh, for a lot of the guys who fly GA, um, don't have a lot of money. They they put it in their plane and they want to have some fun. Um, but when fuel is almost triple, it's really difficult to uh, fly the hours you want to fly. Put it that way. Just true. A lot of guys cut way back on flying. They did fly, just cut way back on flying. Because if you have a $4,000 bill at the end of the year for fuel, now you have an $8,000, $9,000 fuel bill at the end of the year. So it's a lot of money. So there's a TFR here later um, at 5 o'clock. Uh, so we're going to have to get back before then, which we will. Uh, pray. And uh, that's really about it. Do the run up up here, 2-2, two, two, one uh, taxiway, Alpha. And then we'll uh, taxi out on Alpha 4 to get to the uh, runway, 2-2, two, 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 and then we'll be out of here. We'll do the checklist though first. And we'll get some fuel maybe down at Braden Air Park down there. The short runway, I haven't flown down there probably in a year and a half, so. Um, this is when your skills <laughs> hopefully come into play. That's why you got to practice. Um, I did get myself just current a month ago or so before Oshkosh for IFR uh, with a safety pilot. Um, so um, we'll check out the uh, short runway <laughs> experience. I'll do that in a while. And this sticky thing on my CO detector has got a little soft, so it's been falling off, especially in the heat. I gotta put some more double-sided table in there, but in the event, let's do the checklist. Actually, let's hook up the uh, GPS first. Um, where, where, what's the, the identifier? I haven't been there in such a long time in Braden. Um, I believe, let's see, I'm not gonna believe, yeah, 26 November. So let's just go direct to 26 November. Um, 26, it's already there, knows I've been there before. Uh, we'll just do that. We'll just activate it. We're gonna go up to 4500. We'll look at the clouds, make sure we're not gonna be in them. Um, good thing. My buddy is on a cruise right now. A Disney cruise, and I was supposed to go, but it's a whole nother story. Okay. Oh, that GPS is set up for direct. Um, the heading is going to be, the course heading is 199. We'll put that in here. Um, I already have the altimeter set. I already have 4,500 foot, 4,500 feet bug there. And um, let's do a run-up. Let's check out, see how the engine's doing and the mags and all that fun stuff. And then let's put the flaps are way down. Okay, so let's do this real quick. I did the walk around this morning, checked everything. Brakes are set, fuel pump, trim. Let's do the trim because that's way down, way off. Wrong, wrong way. It was way down. They're just, they're just checking some of the stuff there. All right, we're in a takeoff spot there. Um, and we'll put the flaps in. That's good. Okay. Flight controls, free and clear. Down. I'm going to check this because they took the um, aileron off to fix the uh, little anger rash I occurred. Okay, mixture. Now we'll go to 1900. Pretty close right there, and we'll do right and left mag check. So right mag, nice drop. EGTs are climbing, that's good, back to both. EGTs go down, the RPMs back up, left mag. RPMs go down, EGTs are going up, that's good, back to both. RPMs are going up, and the EGTs are going down. So that's perfect there. Uh, prop. Cycle prop. RPMs down. Oil pressure.
pressure down, and nothing on the windshield. Perfect. So we'll put that back in, and we're gonna do a carb. RPM to go down perfectly, about 70-ish. That's good there. But no vacuum pump, we have um, amps are good, volts are good, fuel pressure is awesome. Oil pressure is good, oil temperature is good, and in friction lock, we'll loosen that, put it back to the idle here, 1,000 RPMs. Then 15%, we already got 15% flaps. Top RPM mixture is going to be best. RP is off. Pitot heat is not on. We don't need that. Fuel pump not yet. Laying lights coming on. Positioning lights. Um, not, we don't need the positioning lights. So anti-collision light is on. Strobes are on. We don't need pitot heat. Landing light is on. And the doors. Already locked the hatch back in the back. Um, doors. Landing light is on. Strobes are on. Time set. Take off. Full throttle. Okay. So we're going to rotate at around 60 knots. Okay, the checklist is complete. Everything looks good. And that's the uh, the yellow here is the future um, TFR over Orange County. They're going to practice most likely for the air show. All right, so let's get out here. Let's do it. And we're going to go to 3275. is already in there on the approach. We'll, we'll get them one flight following. Then they'll have us go over to Allentown. And uh, it should be a pretty much smooth flight. Some clouds in the area, we will avoid them if they get at our altitude. Mr. Correction props pull forward. Fuel pump's now coming on. Let's make sure no one's on the base here. Orange County traffic, good morning. Uh, anybody for base of final 2 2? I just went by, no Orange County traffic, uh, Mooney 688. Some of them are taking 2 2 for departure straight out. Full pumps now on. Okay, enough, everything's clear of the Johnson Bar area. Don't want to mess that up because you'll smash your phone if it's down there. And why have that extra stress, right? <laughs> what I forgot to do, and I, I got to put that on my checklist the backup. Barometer needs to be set, so we'll do that in the air. It's off by a little bit. Okay, we're all lined up here. Everything's good. Just rich props pull forward, and let's do it. All right, nice and easy on the throttle. Uh, right rudder, nice cool morning. All right, we're full power. A little bit of right rudder for the P factor, and we're 55. Go for 60, just a little bit more, and we're 60. Two in the air. Here we go. Let's go flying. Trim down. And the gear can go up. The reason why I put the gear up early, like I still have some runway space here, is because it's a hard it's hard to get that gear up over eighty miles an hour. So but it's easy to put it right back down if you had to. It flaps can come up, it's cool out. We got birds. Perfect. Beautiful morning. Nice and cool. And I must have put the wrong identifier in there because it's taking me totally that way in 120, um, 135 nautical miles. Braden is not that far away. So we got to look at that over. It's 2 6 November, I thought it was. Got to relook at that. That's what I thought it was. Uh, I'm going to just check real quick. We'll head that way. But Blairstown's that way. It's not that too far from Blairstown. Uh, Braden. Oh, November 4 3, see? So I have in there. Uh, November, I thought that was off, 4-3, enter, and then, uh, enter, there we go. I thought we were off on that because, I was like, why is it taking us that way? I had, um, Ocean City, New Jersey in there. Oh, that's okay. We, we caught that pretty quick. Orange County traffic, uh, moving the partner pattern to the southwest, see ya. 
Lee. Yo. What's up? Hey, bud. All right, not a big deal. Some clouds up here, a uh, little haze. We'll uh, avoid them, the clouds. The haze, not a big deal. And pull the power back. That power pull back will save the neighbors from uh, hearing noise first thing in the morning. All right, fuel pump can come off, land lake can come off. We're good there. And we'll go over to New York approach. Team Boston 134.0, good day. New York, good morning. November 6887 November request. 6887 November, go ahead. Good morning, sir. We're at Mooney, just a part of Orange County. Mike off Juliet, uh, headed to Brain Airport, November 43, climbing through 2,400 for 4,500. Requesting flight follow, sir. Stand by for code. All right. 960, climb and maintain 17,000. Contact Boston, 134.0. Let them know the speed. Have a good day. They're going to give me an altimeter change anyway, so we'll just hold off on the standby. 6887 November, squawk 4252. 4252 to box 8, so November. 69, you guys went higher, do you want to stay at 5? Jet Edge 59, you guys went higher than that, or do you want to stay at 5? Yeah, we'll look higher. <laughs> All right, you, I'm sorry, it kind of broke up there. You want higher? Yes, sir, please. We'll uh, look a bit higher for Jet Edge 59. Okay, let me give Boston Center a call and get back to you in a few. Copy that. Thank you. Uh, some clouds here and there. We'll be over them. Uh, we got winds, uh, a crosswind component. Oh, checking in. I was on the line. At uh, 21 knots out of 321. I don't know if you guys can see it. You're not at 1129. Your departure proceed right to Mislin. Maintain one six thousand. 7 November, radar contact, maintain VFR, steward altimeter 2996. 2996 will maintain VFR, 8 November, thanks, sir. On course heading now, sir. On course heading is Alright, we got play following, let's get on course a little bit. Uh, 4,500, and that's basically it. Um, it should be a, a pretty good flight today. Um, a little bit later, be some clouds. I don't think I'm going to have to file anything. Um, we'll stay below. Nice jet up above us at about uh, 2,000 feet. 134.3, they're going to uh, help you out when they can. Copy that, sir. Thank you. Appreciate the help. Uh, 34-3, So it's a, a 20... November, New York departure. Cedar Rock Buffalo Airport, climb and maintain 16. 20-degree crosswind correction. Um, and that pretty much lines up with the uh, indicator there. Uh, amazing, right? I'll pull the power back a little more. And get that fuel back. Need some of that fuel. November 6887, November, contact New York approach 120.15. 20.158, September, good day. New York, good morning, Moody. 8, Center members with you, 4,000 for 4,500. Say 20.15. New York, good morning, Mooney. 6887 November, contact New York approach 120.15. Yeah, 20.158 November. Love that playback. Try a little bit in another couple seconds here. The playback function is really good uh, because if you just to just to say, hey, what, what do you say or she say and play it back up to six times, I believe, on, Approaching on this, altitude. the PS. All right, 200 feet, 4,500. New York, good morning, 
Booney, November 6, 88, seven members with you, 4,500. Let's uh, go back to New York. And New York approach, uh, Moody November 6, 88, November. Nobody home at uh, 120.15. All right, it might be the uh, position at altitude. Let me give them a call and see what frequency they want you on. Uh, thank you, sir. Uh, 8, November. Those poor guys got to deal with us GA guys. <laughs> but they love their job. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully ATC loved their job. 6887 November, contact 125.5. 125.5. November, thank you, sir. Air Command Baron 307 to Whiskey 8.5 to maintain 4,000. 4,000, break at 307. 1660 at 5,000, speed 210. At 5,000, flow 210, United 1660. Doing 75 to maintain 3,000. 3,000, 1085. Busy. And New York, I'm going to 688, so November's with you, 4,500. Safety is a concern, you know, uh, we need to call flight following, but they got so much going on, as you can hear. And New York approach, I'm going to 687 members with you, uh, 4,500. 687 members with you, 4,500. Systems working awesome. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. We might have to switch tanks. Switch side. Yeah, let's switch tanks. Got it. We got Sussex right over there. Right underneath us, basically. I like to switch tanks by an airport if I could. All right, fuel pump coming on. And we're going to switch over to the right tank. Break out 3662. 5-3, New York approach. You said you had the field in sight? Three, clear visual approach runway uh, two three more sound. I just hit a bunch of bugs. Look at this. Uh, Thirty five. Pump coming off. Uh, Three hundred thirty six ninety seven seven thousand Quebec. And fuel pressure still good. 50, I hit a bunch of bugs 20, into the windshield. 20, 20, I forgot my spray. Heading one two zero down to four thousand. Brickyard thirty four fifty nine. And sixteen sixty one one two zero. One twenty heading in at sixteen sixty. 291, reduced you to 210, turn right, heading 090. Fuel pressure is good. Shall we have a 17 knot crosswind? 91, 5, 0, descending, 5,000. Heading 125,000, break at 35, 5,000. Uh, 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 u
at 4,500 feet. Probably had a union meeting at 4,500 feet talking about these planes killing them all. And then I just ended up taking them all out. Two more down there. <laughs> Whatever. It's all good. As long as it's not birds. Looks great. 3662, turn 10 degrees left. 10 degrees left, break out 3662. And then 291, reduce you to 180, then the 1714. I already see the smokestacks down, down there. It looks like uh, winds are calm down there below. So we use one, I think one, I think it's 18. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Uh, information. Yeah, it's 18. Uh, I think it's 18. Let's see. Yep, one, uh, 18. We'll use 18. So left crosswind. Uh, left, the midfield left downwind. 9, fighting 0, 5. 1, 8. 18, 100 foot runway. Yippee. Which is not bad. One nine zero maintain two thousand five hundred to establish on the wall. Glad to clear down. Last minute to approach. Right one six. Hands over to Allentown soon. Six sixty. Two ninety one. Two ninety one. One two zero nine two ninety one. So there's a TFR down here. Where are we here? Two four zero to join. Still clear. Break your other six sixty two. Thirty six ninety seven. Reduce you to one eight zero. That's the vice president's TFR down there and. I don't see the TFR United for the air show over there. And a half for 7, we're we're going to go to Ocean City, New Jersey. Uh, that's 26 November. That's where we're going to go. And over to Tower. And then we're going to ride to the air show. Look how busy he is. Romeo is current speed 210. Speed 210, we'll get Romeo United 570. And 1666 heavy turn riding 110. It's listed to it's like, one amazing. Zero, United 1666 heavy. 291, 3 from Peterborough, turn riding 190, maintain 3000, till established, cleared out, less than a 2-2 approach. 190, 3000, till established, clear for the ILS, 2-2 left approach, 291. Cepus 579, just to maintain 3000. 3000, Cepus 572, Cosmic, Service 5. 140 true airspeed at knots, and uh, we're pretty much level here. 291, 22.8 over 24. A uh, lower power setting. Uh, um, 9.5 gallons an hour. I can bring it back more, but I don't like to run it too hot. 210, then down to 5,000. Can't get it back. I get it down to 8.8. Uh, they're too busy. I'm, I'm VFR. Once they go downhill, I usually like to tell them. Um, you know, I do like to tell them because they know, let's say, know what I'm doing. We don't, have to. we don't have to, but it's a good courtesy to do that. He's so busy, he's not going to even uh, acknowledge me, probably. 3697, 5 from uh, I'll pull the power back a little bit. we we'll go downhill. Yeah, I should be in Allentown soon, actually. turn riding 090. Alright, turn 090, 321. United 570, turn left setting 110 to maintain 6,000. 110, 6,000, United 570. Put up to 3,500 initially. 697, maintain 170. Actually, go to 2,500, going this direction. We'll go down 2,000 feet. 6887, November, contact downtown approach 124.45. 2445, good day, thank you. 8 November. Speed 180. Downtown, good morning, uh, Moody, November 6, 88, seven November is with you, 3,900, descending to 2,500. Moody, 6, 8, 8, 7, November, Allentown Approach, Allentown Center, 3000, zero, zero, zero. descent your discretion at or above 3,500 now, and uh, I'll have lower for you shortly, and just verify you're at 3,800 descending. That's correct, we'll go down to 3,500 and stay right there uh, for 8, November. What's the altimeter again? I'm sorry, sir. Downtown Senator 3008, or correction 3000. Zero, zero. Zeros, thank you, 8th of November. 3500. Approaching altitude. Okay, there you go. Now you got to be at 3500. We'll so slow us down a little bit. There's a reason, you know. This guy slowed his plane down. The guy's circling down there. He's low. He's, oh, he's high. Never mind. All right, level off. And put in the back up here. Zero, zero. Good. All right, we'll stay, whoa, we'll stay right here. 3,500, all right. Put that power back in a little. The land light can come on. It's an LED, why not? And it's charging up nice, I can tell it's charging. 
Elevator is charging. A little bit more mixture. As you get lower, you need more mixture. Here's my smokestacks. Uh, good. There's fogs in the valleys, like usual. Um, and um, airport. In the area where the airport is, it looks like it's clear. Um, Braden is very hard to find. Uh, there's no question. It's very hard to find. Uh, because it's a it's small runway, it's a short runway, and it's narrow. Um, and there's not like hangar, like, like a lot of hangars. There's hangars on it. There's not like a lot of hangars on there to where you can kind of pick it out. Uh, you know, it's just there. <laughs> but a good point of knowing where it's at is I know the solar field is uh, right by it. Um, basically on the approach end of uh, 1-8 is the solar fields. Uh, so I know... Solar field, I don't see them yet. Uh, we're still 20 miles away, 18, mi 18 miles away. I just got that push. It's a nice push over from the, the ridge over here. The wind's coming up and over. Uh, from the west-ish. Um, yeah, 315. So it's coming over the hill, giving us a little bit of a turbulent, very very slight. Nothing, nothing major today. We're still at 135 true now. And let's just slow down a little bit more because uh, when he tells me to go down, I need to go down. And the Moody, without speed brakes, uh, is fast. 13, in 4, Going down. Four, requesting, uh, it's pretty fast. An AT-13 ounce on a the level cruise, for what it is, this plane. Uh, but when you go downhill, Zero, even faster. Get really and without speed brakes, like you can't put the gear down. I can put it down 120 miles an hour, but you're, I'm doing blow past that. And so this this one has miles per hour still in my backup D10A. This has all been knots, uh, so I've been transitioning to knots. Uh, but I do like to keep this in miles per hour only because it's a good, just a good glance. Okay, that's miles per hour. My God, I know my knots here. Uh, just so I've been flying miles per hour forever. Uh, so in the last, I think, eight, eight months or so, I made this knots. Um, so. So I use that like kind of as like a reference. So I'm going to change it eventually. I've been telling myself that for months uh, to get used to the knots, but, you know, whatever. I don't like landing 3-6. 6887 November, traffic 11 o'clock, 2 miles northwest bound, type of known, that's gate 3100. So we're looking for the traffic for 8th of November. Landing light on. Oh, traffic's in sight. We'll maintain visual separation for 8th of November. 8th of November, Roger. And what can I expect to get lower, sir? 8th of November, it would be for a descent. Your discretion. My discretion for descent, uh, 8th of November. Thank you, sir. Okay, I'll go downhill now. Let's put some mixture. Um, Mark 5 Fox, you're off the fighting at 360. I need you at or below 2,500. That's the third time I forgot what I was saying, sorry. Get down to, uh, we can go down to 1400 now. Traffic pattern is, I believe. Let's go to information again. Yeah, 1400. Look how quick that was to get what you, information you need. One push of a button. The Dynon Skyview HDS. Great bang for your money, folks. You can't kind of get them right now. You can, but you can only get one screen at a time. Let's say changed it. Uh, they're just again like everything else. You can't get the parts. You can't get the manufacturers to build them fast enough. Yeah, that's missing. This is missing. It's, it's everywhere. Number 9, Victor Bravo, after completion of your approach, you maintain VFR. I'm going to go a little bit left and then head towards the airport. Oh, that's what I was going to say, 360, because November 721, connect tower, one, it's two, zero, uphill. One, so if I land 360, it's 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 hard. and It's, it's not like it's uphill like this. It's, it's kind of flat, and then it goes uphill. So you kind of got to land almost like in a flare, per se. Well, you land in a flare anyway, but what I'm saying is you got to, like you're still LBT climbing a little bit to hit that. Three zero zero zero. That's right, or you'll bounce, like I always freaking do. <laughs> Landing 3-6. So I, 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 at least I count them as two, three, you know, uh, landings. LV2, red I'm kidding, I don't count them as landings. For airport, uh, say destination. But the, uh, looks pretty calm down here, so. Let's get down, let's get down. Yeah, we'll pull the, Roger, and pull the power back, make sure a little bit more. Pull the power back a little bit more. Very good. Keep the prop out a little bit, whatever. 
It's a slight uh, crab. Right uh, a little bit of a crab up here. I'll just up where you're going. Laying lights on, fuel pump not yet. We're all set. We're going to get the, the flap and all that stuff in soon. I lost the solar fields in the trees. Um, yeah. No procedure for a center line. There's only the VOR, which doesn't help me. Uh, we'll find it. We will find it. Got a little more power. LV2, is that uh, Muhlenberg Hospital? Got it in sight. In downtown now, we got the uh, brain in sight. We can cancel uh, the apart. 8th of November. LV2, Roger, I'll come back to you. Oh, I got it. I had it. It's going. In downtown, Booty uh, 6 of November has the uh, brain in sight, sir. A frequency change. Take a phone up for it, turn answer, say again. Uh, Mooney 688 November has braided in sight, we can cancel with you. Mooney 6887 November, ready to serve terminated squawk, VFR, if we can change approved, good day. VFR approved, uh, thank you sir, good day. Braided traffic, good morning, uh, Mooney 688 November is about uh, five miles out uh, to the east. We come to number 45, midfield left now, wind for a 1-8, Braden. There, no, I where, just had it. I just had it. Reports out there. I want to stay right about here. Actually, but I don't want to get any lower than this right now. Until I find the airport. I lost the solar field, too. Uh, let's see. Yeah, it's off to my right somewhere. Oh, there it is. Okay. Got it. There's the solar fields, so we had to come out and come in. We're slowing down nicely. We're still not in gear speed. We're 130 miles an hour, vacated here. Um, my home, my hometown, Phillipsburg, is just over the ridge, and the Phillipsburg High School is on top of a ridge, right there. All right. The prop in a little bit here. Mixture coming in now. So look, we'll look at the um, windsock just to make sure. I'm going to make a right turn. Okay, we can put almost flaps in. Okay, put approach flaps in. Perfect. And Braden traffic. Moody's on a one mile 45 for the midfield. Left down one eight. Braden. Nice, nice, nice. Nice speeds. Beautiful speeds. I love flying. Camera turned off. I don't know why. Which did. Bye -bye. This one behind me did. Um, I do love flying when it's calm. It's just such a. It's just so nice to be able to fly when it's calm. And Braden traffic, uh, Mooney is now midfield. Left downwind, 1 8. Braden, be a full stop. All right, so let's get the gear. Speed is there. What well, gear is coming down? And gear is locked. Shift for rich prop now coming in full forward. And then we'll put one more pump of flaps. I say notch, but it's whatever. All right, so we got to get this pretty good. It's a short runway. Fuel Leaving pump is now altitude. on. There's the guys can't see it, I don't think, uh, but there's the uh, solar field. Everything is green, so it's even harder to uh, find them because the trees uh, cover it with the leaves on them. Gear check one more time. We're good. Green, we have green. We have mixture virtual possible four lane lights on, strobes are on, and we have uh, fuel pumps on. We're almost ready to turn that left base. 45 over the shoulder. That's what I like. And we're good. Around the solar fields we go. Braden traffic. Uh, Mooney is turning left base. 1 8 to Braden. Alright. Around the solar field. Like I always do. 
Nothing's still here. They didn't change anything. All right, so let's get full flaps now. Let's get set up here. Okay, let's get set up, set up. Okay, we're all good there. Uh, trim up a little bit. And bring in traffic. Video's turning final. 1-8, full stop. Break. We'll watch our speeds now. we got to be not too fast now. If you're a little fast here, uh, the moon is going to float, and you need to um, pretty much go around. That's basically what I do. So I'll mess around trying to push it down. This doesn't make any sense. But plenty of fuel. No rush when you're flying. I learned my lesson. No rush putting the plane away. 500. We're 500 feet down level. And we're right on a 1-8. Nice approach here. We're stable. Braden traffic, uh, but he's uh, short final, 1-8. Beautiful stop, Braden. 75, I like 75 right here. Let's get down. All right, we're all good. Let's check that gear one more time. Gear's good. And one more type of trim. There you go. 71, a little slow. We'll put in the power a little bit. Nice, nice approach. A gear check one more time. And we're locked there. 71, 72. We're good and good. The power in just a little bit, little bit, little bit, and we are idle. Touchdown right about here, like right, right where I like a touchdown. Perfect. Look at that, there's the end of the runway, folks. That's the end of the runway, right there. <laughs> Pretty short. So if in the again in the Mooney, how everybody else, other Mooney pilots feel. But if you're, you know, just even a couple knots faster Penridge than usual. Traffic, Malibu zero, Romeo Delta one five, fifteen miles west of Bethel, landing at Penridge. No breathing traffic. Mooney back taxiing uh, three six. Spread. Sorry, back taxi one eight. Breathing. Um. You, you need to pretty much go around. Now, my rule of thumb is if I don't land for the taxiway is to go into the Woody Parker airplane, I go around. That's just my thing. Uh, I don't want to jam the brakes and start, because it's down, see this part here, uh, again, you can't really see, but right where that ends, that little strip there, is where it goes downhill. And I don't want to, if you can see a bunch of skid marks always down here. I don't want to jam and then there's some puddles here uh, and then slip and get it sideways. And I don't, it's just worth, it's just not worth it for me. Um, so that's why I typically would go around if I'm too high, and, uh, too fast even. Not even really too high, but too fast. That was good. We made it to the Braden Air Park in Easton, Pennsylvania. Thanks, you guys, for flying along with me. It's been a first-time video in a long time where I flew somewhere with you guys, besides uh, Shkosh. Uh, so thank you so much for flying along. Uh, merch, pilot411.com. And fuel pumps off. And... Uh, Thank you guys for the support on Facebook. Uh, we are approaching 100,000 followers. Uh, amazing on Facebook. So subscribe to the channel. Like what I'm doing. And you guys can email me at pilot 11 at gmail.com as well. We'll see you on the next one. Be safe and fly safe. And Braden traffic. Uh, Moody clear. 1-8 Braden.